I'm Kristen Sutton. I'm your communications director. I know that we're throwing a lot at you digitally right now. And this elf on the shelf is not going to help. But I got some millennials on my counter that are going to show you how to do all these things. For YouTube, we are going to open up whatever web browser you are used to using, and we're going to go to YouTube. And you don't have to have a YouTube account, but if you do, then you can subscribe to the channel, and it will give you notifications when we go live and some other things. Um, you can have access to so I'm seeing my view as the editor of this account but usually you'll see a subscribe option up here so when we go live it's gonna pop up on this main window here and it'll have a little red box that says live and you'll just click on that we're gonna start the live stream five to ten minutes before the service actually starts so that you can log in uh, you can get on the channel and it can start going for you but then also if you missed a service and you want to go back and watch it you can go to our videos and you can see any of our previous prayer times any of our previous um, services that have been recorded on YouTube if you only have a phone you can also go and download the YouTube app on your phone and do the same thing just search for Smyrna First United Methodist Church this same channel will come up and you'll be able to watch it from there as well if you have a smart TV you can download the YouTube app same thing just search for the Smyrna First United Methodist Church page on YouTube and whenever we launch a live video it will show up on that and you have access to all of these accounts as well if you do not have a smartphone or a smart TV rather you can purchase a Google Chromecast which will allow you to access YouTube and all sorts of different apps into a TV that is not a smartphone another option is also the Amazon Fire Stick and they have a, a whole line of these kinds of streaming products and then another option is the Roku streaming stick as well in any of those are going to accomplish getting you to YouTube getting you to the channel again you don't have to have an account but if you do then our content will show up on your main page and it will be kind of on this what you see here the recommended pages here but really all you need to do is search for the church's name you'll see this icon for our YouTube account page and you're good to go